ain't no special holiday coming up that involves a pig. Do you know Owen? Can everybody say oink? Oink! Wow, if you paint half as good as you oink, we're in business. So everybody has two brushes. You've got your wide flat brush and you've got your small pointy brush. I want you to say hello to your little small pointy brush. upside down part. Is anybody going to come over and measure and tell you did it wrong or it's too big or too small or too whatever? No. This is your painting and as long as you're happy with it, that's all that matters. Fill this area in so you can take some more white and pink and just paint in that snout. And for this, we don't need to be, you know, too perfect. There's no such thing as perfect, right, you guys? So let's get perfect out of our head. Let's just paint this in however we feel like it. If you want it to be really neat, you can go in one direction, but you can also kind of have fun and make some kind of loose, fun brush strokes. We're going to come down underneath here, we're going to make the bottom, which is going to be like a wide U, but at the top of that shape, we want it to come in, like this.
So what shape are his ears, you guys? What shape is that? We're going to go to our big brush. So put your little brush in the water while we're working with the big brush. Right, let's get some white and a little tiny bit of tan. Try to paint in the direction of the curves of his face. Take your little brush. We're going to get some white and pink again. And we're going to go up into the ear. And we're going to make another similar shape as the outer shape. We're just going to make it smaller on the inside and we're going to paint that in with the pink. We're going to do that in both ears. So it's just another smaller leaf shape or what did we call it? Rounded triangle. Your pink is great, Gabriel. We have the pink on our brush right now. What we're going to do is to keep the pink on the brush and take a little bit more white and a little tap of black. And when I say little tap of black, I mean like barely even touch it. Because we just want a very pinkish grayish color. Lay a little bit of this gray in little 
choppy strokes. Okay, so I'm kind of coming down and down, just like that. And then maybe throw in a couple more little strokes inside the ear. How are we doing, you guys? Uh, I feel confident. Yeah, who, who's feeling confident? Lucy? Yeah. Just going to add on a couple of little, very light strokes. little black, just a tap. I'm going to go to each side of the indent where the, the pig's face kind of comes in and we're going to go inside a little bit and we're going to put a circle.
still in the area in between his snout and his mouth. So this little area right here is going to be all black. Make 
these are more fluffy areas if you think like your edges got a little too chopped off. So you can soften up your edges. Snorty. Dry white. 